Hey, what's up, YouTube? I uh, just wanted to go through one of the features that I really like about DoorDash and the main reason why I chose this over you know, other apps, uh, and it's the vehicle selection. You know, my primary mode of transportation, initially, I was considering a motorcycle. You know, I thought, I, thought about that. Uh, I live in a city. You know, I live in Boston, and this area is always crowded, so I was assuming, I was thinking, you know, using um, a motorcycle i'd be able to get around town really fast you know that was the main thing speed uh you know pick up and then zoom really quickly uh to the drop off and i did that for a while and then you know, i realized you know parking uh well first of all my bike was just way too loud and obnoxious and delivering at night and and in urban uh, you know quieter areas i felt bad almost you know especially even at pickups you know people would be sitting outside dining and I'd pull up my exhaust would be extremely loud you know almost annoying uh you know I wear like uh, earplugs so I wouldn't really hear it but they were probably like oh my goodness but anyways um eventually you know, I made the decision to switch to a scooter which has been great you know, this thing uh, I use a Piaggio Liberty 150S it's uh it's, it's basically a Vespa uh, but plastic here, and so it's like half the price, but you can really get around town, you know, really well, uh, pick up and drop off, you can park anywhere, uh, and it's even fast enough to get on the highway, you know, if you have to go a few exits, then there's no uh, issue there, uh, but the main reason I chose DoorDash over Uber Eats, uh, is because on that app, uh, for a scooter, if you're thinking of using a scooter to deliver, uh, you can only use up to 50cc motor, uh, which really limits the areas you can get to and the speed you can get there. Uh, so on DoorDash, you can use, uh, you know, any mode of transportation, really. It was super easy uh, getting uh, uh, all my modes of transportation approved. You know, I'm, I have a bicycle on there, a car, a motorcycle, and a scooter. Um, and all you have to do is use the app to contact DoorDash and let them know. And then within two minutes, it's already added onto your app as a mode of transportation for you to select, um, which is great. Yeah. But one thing I found that's interesting is that depending on which mode of transportation you choose, uh, the map, the zone map that shows what areas are, are busy and not busy, uh, it differs. So say uh, you know, you're in a car uh, and then it says very busy. And then you switch to scooter and then it just says busy, you know, in the exact same area. Or sometimes, you know, you'll be in one mode, say you're the car, and then you switch to another, say a bicycle, and then the mode just completely disappears. I mean, the zone disappears. So really, depending on which mode you choose, uh, your map varies. Uh, so uh, what I find is I believe that the scooter and the bicycle show the same... Uh, you know, heat signature, busy map. Um, but I could be wrong, you know, it's just from my experience. But a lot of times, um, you know, I'll be in the scooter nine times out of 10. And the only time I'm in the car is if it's like raining or uh, really cold. But that's one thing you have to think about, you know, your market, you know, and what makes sense. You know, I live in Boston, you can't be using the scooter uh, year round, all right. Definitely, when it gets cold, or uh, if it snows, you know it's not gonna happen. So you have to choose what works for you and what works uh, for your region. Uh, but I would love to live in a climate where I could, uh, you know, use the scooter year round. The scooter is just so much better in my opinion than the car. Yeah, you know, aside from wearing the backpack, and you have to wear a backpack. Also, obviously, it's insulated. Uh, but and just parking uh, at pick up and drop off, it makes it so much easier. And dealing with traffic, you're able just to zip right in between cars. Uh, so in my opinion, it's the best mode of transportation for any uh, you know, DoorDash, Uber Eats, Grubhub. Uh, but let me know down in the comments what you prefer to use uh, and if it's working in your, your city. All right. Well, talk to you later. Bye.